we're back at it again. We got a 10 by 15 unit. It is packed from the packed to the brim, wall to wall, floor to ceiling. It is jam packed. At least that's what it looks like in the pictures. And we're out here at this big old box. Literally just looks like a big box, public storage. Never been to this facility before. Out in Peachtree Corners, Georgia. Paid $310 for this unit. But hopefully, it's unit, let's see. Unit 1213, so I'm hoping it's on this main floor here. Let's see. I have no idea because the way public storage does some of these facilities now, you go and pay at another location and then they just send you over here with a code. So I just come over here and start wandering the halls and see if I can find 1213. There's 1300s. So maybe over this way. I hope that's 14 again. But yeah, just wandering around. Oh, 1211, 12, 12. Ooh, and it's right here. 1213. 1213, yeah, and the door's right there. Man, how lucky can we get? The door's right here, we're right here. That's pretty good for a facility like this because we could have been all the way up on the third, fourth floor, however many floors are in this place. Way back there, it goes way on back. All right, so give me just a minute. I'm gonna get this lock off. I got the code here for it, and then we will open this thing up. Yeah, All right, let's open this thing up. Uh, whoo. Oh my goodness. Oh. Something right here. Part of this bed frame. This thing. Oh my gosh, I mean this thing is just jammed full. Look at that. All the way up into the ceiling up there. But boxes, boxes, an old set of mattresses. Pretty sure it's probably, you know, probably an elderly person's stuff. And then um, right here I saw this pogo stick box when I was bidding. It kind of looked like an older box. So, and this older floor lamp right here. But man, it is jammed in there. There's a griddle, or at least a griddle box. But boxes stacked up and going all the way. It's, it's going to be hard to get stuff out of here at first because it's all the way jammed up in the ceiling. The we got the wild bean, bean coffee <laughs> mugs here. Mootsies, tootsies. But look, in Look, all the brooms. I know. <laughs> On the way here, we realized that we didn't bring a broom and a dustpan. And normally when you don't bring one, you don't find any. And when you do bring them, you find tons of them. But luckily this time, there's one, two, three brooms right here in the front. So we'll be all right on getting it swept up. Here's some paper towels if we need them, man. But, um, oh, look at this. This is a game right here. Rebound. I don't know where all the pieces are. I used to have this game. This is a fun game. You actually had rubber bands here on the end, these little things that rolled, and you tried to make them stop on these little point sections right here. But I don't know where in the world or if there's going to be any pieces. There's a, whoop, there's the dustpan. Yep, one, two, three, four, five. They've been <clears throat> in auction status five different times. And then, but that, that's how a lot of these are. They get into auction status, they come, they cut their lock off. Put the sill on it but then the person pays back up so then the customer comes and puts their lock on it again so five times that we can tell with the locks yeah. are still here that that's happened and then they finally you know a lot of times finally something ends up happening and they just can't pay it anymore all right we managed to squeeze just a couple things out and stuff's falling out we got plastic shelves and everything so let's take a look in a couple boxes to see what kind of stuff we're dealing with there. It looks like it's gonna be anything good or what? Now this box here does not look good. It looks like old musty shoes. That's not a good one there. It does not mean there's not gonna be good stuff but that box there. Fortunately, a lot of those women's shoes, really any shoes, they start getting really old like that. Typically not very good because they just start to dry rot and get discolored. This just looks like, I don't know what it looks like. There's some brand new disc, computer disc. 
We've got keys. It's done in here. There is purse. Let me figure out what's in this box here. Uh oh, we got jewelry boxes. Let's see. There's something in here. All right, right off the bat here. This is costume, but that's name brand Napier. That was $25 whenever that was bought there. There's another piece there with some matching earrings. So it could be all costume, but that's fine. We got some, um, looks like some faux pearls, maybe. Let's see if I can open this clasp and then look in there. If I can get that open, I don't think it's right. I don't see any markings. That one's not wanting to cooperate. So there's a whole bunch of, a whole bunch of jewelry boxes right here oh, look at that that is I don't guess that's it I don't see any marks I thought maybe it might be silver but earrings that's some players I don't think that's nothing that's costume there yep Arisa, and that was eighteen dollars. Whenever it was bought, empty bag. And they keep coming. Is there more? Let's see. That might be about it. Oh, there's another one there. A Worthington little set here. All right. All right, this box here, I just opened it up and we've got some old bathing powder. Okay. Um, some kind of, I don't know what that even is, bathing powder. This says prayer things, prayer things. Silver plated platter there, and then all in here. Um, I don't know prayer things. I mean, I don't know what none of this really even is. Um, rose water, some kind of I don't know, Catholic prayer type thing. We got some brass here. Orange food coloring. Looks like a honey bear right there. Time. Hmm. I don't know if they get like, I don't know, Catholic or something like that, or, or somebody's doing um, spells or something. I don't know yet. Yeah, there you go. All right, so there's a couple boxes just to kind of give us an idea to start with. Some good, some bad. But a lot of stuff to go for sure. All right, this box says front on it. Front, front. Something fashion maybe? I don't know. But then, like, that says front on it. So I don't know if that's, like, a front room. That says front on it back there. Yeah, maybe they want it in the front of the unit. So that's like sewing stuff it looks like here. Sewing and yeah, kind of craft type stuff, toothbrush cover. What kind of stuff is this? It is a hair layering systems and bags. Olay 
daily facials. It looks like maybe more jewelry down in here. More jewelry. This kind of looks like a you know, costume, nice looking costume for the most part. Olay. Fingernails. <laughs> this is probably more jewelry. No, it's a jewelry box, but it's empty. There's a couple more shoe boxes there. That's all going to be... I guess those are like little bracelets. Like cheap little bracelets. Incense. One more box. Right here. Shoe box coming here. And just a little bit. There's like a necklace. Like another necklace. Magical relighting candles. All right. All right. We're gonna hit this box here. Ann just cut it open. She said this one was heavy. Let's see. We got a piece of cardboard, and then we got okay. blankets. But there's more stuff underneath, let's see. So there's a layer of blankets and towels and stuff. And then what do we have? All kinds of stuff. Maybe there's a hat and scarf set. What are these here? Wicker white, so little like ceramic dishes with wicker baskets around them. And there's several of them there. And here's some old, some new old stock winter woods candles, like Christmas candles. And then we got little manicure sets here that are new, new old stock, new old stock. Looks like more of that kind of stuff down here, like an old purse, but with the tags on it. Halloween candy, tissue paper. So all kinds of stuff down in here. Um, was this a curtain? Standard case. This uh, pillow cases, I think. And lots more. If you look down in here, let's see something in a bag here. Let's see if I can tear into it. Glass candle, some kind of candle holder. And then here we got little bags. There's just a whole bunch of stuff here. Mm-hmm. And that's like a little glass. It's like a swan, a little glass swan. I don't know if it's broke or not. There's a couple swans in there. I think, it's, I think they're just not. You just have to, once you get them out of there, stand them up. All right. All right, another one Ann just got down and opened up for me. Uh oh, it's going to be Christmas. Tablecloth, okay, right now. All right, we're looking better now than we, we started out a little bit rough, but it's looking a little bit better now. Lots of these boxes here, a lot of new old, new old stock. There's an old Walkman, but it's brand new. A little tea set. It's, it's kind of, you know, grandma looking stuff, but there's new stuff. There's a little basket right there, ceramic basket. Huh? Don't be knocking, Grandma. Well, I'm not. There's a little six-piece stoneware, um, like a little snowman set. And there's more. It's like all down in here. More. Look, there's more of that wicker and whatever you want to call that stuff. These are Christmas candles. So look, all this is all new stuff down here. RCR Royal Crystal Rock. Oh, it's a vase. And more stuff down in there. Um, it says something Kirkland's. Oh, this cool. It's a little elephant candle holder. Looks like there may be two of them there. 12 piece flatware set. So yeah, this whole box looks like it's pretty much all new merchandise. All right, so after that first layer of boxes, you can see back there, more boxes stacked up. There's a, that's a shelf back there, but it's full of boxes. 
looks like another old mattress behind this one but definitely i think this unit's definitely going to be packed okay. all the way from front to back hmm? is that real it is real i don't know if it's alive i don't think it's alive and just so got scared of this hurt. big old bug right here i don't think it's alive it's not going to hurt you though. it would just go flying off but it's not alive <laughs> I don't know if that's a cicada or what. That's kind of, that's kind of what it looks like. All right, a couple more boxes here. What do you got there, Ann? Oh, We've got a little. Nope, oh. not yet. That's new. It's a little it's bit dirty right. because it's open, but it's like a shadow box, little kitchen decorative thing. It's kind of cool, but it's still in the box. And what do we have here? It looks like this is all paperwork. Yeah, FedEx. Um, yep. Paperwork box. J. It looks like it says J. Resumes. Right there. So we're finding. Finding, you know, stuff like paperwork stuff, but then we've got, you know, other ones that have brand new merchandise, brand new old merchandise. So I don't know what's in here. Looks like a lot of bags. Looks like some, I think it is like paper down there, but we got pins and stuff down in the bottom. We have paperwork down in there, underneath the, the bags that are right here. There's another one, front. Something items, front prayer. I don't know. I'm not sure what, <clears throat> and it's kind of more similar, kind of odd stuff. This now this looks like like Pakistan. You know, I don't want to say exactly. exactly I mean, Buddhist maybe stuff. You get an elephant there. Like all kinds of little stuff to hold candles, little stuff to put different stuff in. Okay, this right here, I'm pretty sure. No, this is Hindu. I think that's Hindu. I think you're right. Yeah. Yep believe this is Hindu stuff okay yeah and then this is sandal I think this was um, incense and little bowls another little candle little elephant so this is all little stuff for like Hindu prayer I believe and then right here the bag with some pennies in it yeah, this is all prayer stuff apparently. One more box here and then we're gonna start loading. But if we see anything that's that's really interesting, we'll stop and, and show it. But we're gonna have to just start to um, get busy loading some of this stuff so we can get done sometime in the next week with all this stuff here. But one more box here. Glass decorations, handle with care. And when we open the top here, we got clothing. Clothing. <coughs> So now we figured out that it looks like they were Hindu. And right here we got an elephant statue with a watch hanging on it. Times Square watch. And underneath there, what do we got? There's more stuff wrapped up in some of these clothes. There's a vase, that's a crystal vase. It's a Gorham um, crystal vase made in Germany, it says. <clears throat> And then we got a little little boat there. Lots of different things wrapped up. Oh, this is kind of cool. We got a little Donald Duck. This is out of a cereal. It says Kellogg Company. A little Donald Duck. Kind of a bobblehead. And there's another one down in there. got the see now I think that's I think that's Buddhist I believe so Buddha Hindu I could be wrong I'm not a, definitely not an expert on on that but I, I thought those guys were Buddhist statues and then the other things were Hindu so, and, then it, and then Anne's got a not a new yeah. um, food, food processor 
I mean, it's all there and everything. Yes. It's just, it's Maybe just, um, there. needs a little bit of cleaning. All right, this box here kind of looked like it said guest appliances. Then I open it up here. Look, we got new toys here. We don't see more new toys. This is a huge box, and it's really heavy. Some little praying hands, and then looks like more new stuff. This is kind of cool right here. Oh, it's not in there though. Thought it was gonna be a Volkswagen Beagle, Beetle, like a diecast or something, but it's mugs. But if you look down in there, there's a candle. Okay, and then it said appliances, and then we do have there's a tater twister, some kind of Presto fryer or something down in there. So it looks like maybe that is gonna be once you get in there what a lot of it is. Because many times you do see that, you'll see it'll say something, and then on the top you'll find something else, then the bolt of the box is what it said. But look right here, we got Martha Stewart dishes, we got cling wrap. There's other boxes on there, so it looks like a lot of, a good amount of it is new stuff. Like I keep seeing though, it's, it's new old stuff. It's not new. It's definitely got a few years on it. We did find some toothpaste a minute ago, and it had an expiration date of, I think, 2005 on it. So I'm thinking at least the toothpaste was bought like in the early 2000s. All right, this one says gift items. And then it says candles on the side, and it looks like it is candles. I don't know. Candles they were given as gifts. Sm smells good. The box does. Yeah, it's all new candles. There's some <laughs> common sense candles. Yeah. Common sense? Yeah. Sense or scents? All right. So we got lots of boxes here that we haven't we didn't even open none of these yeah. so no telling what's in them and then we're just kind of opening a few here and there but more boxes here and then another set of mattresses behind here looks like maybe the bottom of a couch but then i see more cardboard right there so it's going to be kind of a mix some furniture and more boxes apparently um, yeah, there's some kind of a quilt. Let's see. American Home Handcrafted Quilt Set. It was TJ Maxx. It was $69.99. I don't know if it's ever been taken out of there. Because so many times when it's in these bags and if it's all folded out, a lot of times that means it has not been taken out. Right, it's hard to fold it back and get, and it, get it into that bag. Yeah, exactly right. And all these little red staples paper boxes so there's this well, i'm thinking this is a name m-a-d-h-u the name of a person this is madu makeup costume so probably makeup maybe some costume jewelry which that looks like that might be what's right here well an empty box but yeah just kind of um Poetry type items and that one there. Alright, just moved a couple of box springs from right here so we can get to a few more things now. Still got a mattress there and another set of mattresses, but lots of little stuff here and look. Here's the toilet paper. Cottonelle. Brand new thing of, of cottonelle. So we're good to go. Look at this right here. Minnie Mouse Vintage Lunch Box. Let's see what's in here. Nothing is in here. And I thought I saw, when we were moving this stuff, stuff was falling over, I thought I saw another one too. I don't know where, it, if there is, I don't know where it went. Oh, there's a globe too, I didn't see that. Oh, it's broke. I wonder if there's a Mickey one. Maybe I was just seeing, maybe it was that one I was seeing. All right, let's see. It's very light. Just some bags. Yeah. 
more big stuff out of the way and we got more boxes back here we got a um, washer and a dryer stacked up back here more boxes we got a christmas item right right here look it's a holiday duck family that's kind of interesting and just so far what we're finding just kind of anything and everything but there is like we've already shown a lot of new stuff here's a new um like a laundry bin it looks like we got some old luggage this looks like old puzzles right here oh and i can see on the edge of it let's see curious i'm just gonna rip a little hole here and they're actually new they've never been done there's a 1500 piece yeah all these see the cardboard has never been cut on all these puzzles at least those right there there's a duck one on the it, it's been open but there's old ducks lined up but a few new puzzles here take it you're there <laughs> all right Well, all right, let's open one more box and see what we got. We haven't really opened many since we've gotten back toward the middle there. Bags, some kind of um, Rada Gold Jewelers. Okay, and then down in there we got paperwork. Organizer. What is this? Uh, makeup. Some of it's new, some of it's been taken out of there. And then when you get down in there, it looks like baskets, pantyhose, before, soap, little, um, what is this, Dove cleansing pillows, paint brushes, new, <laughs> pizza cutter, new. There's more utensils down in there, kind of. Some of it's kind of dollar store looking. Yeah, there you go, one dollar. All right, some of the luggage here, like this one right here, it's got an Indian Airlines security sticker on it. So either they're going to India or somewhere around India. Whole bunch more luggage. It's an all it's all old luggage. All right, we got this big king size mattress here. I'm about to move over and see what's behind there or see what's gonna fall when we move this. It's a wall of boxes. Luckily, nothing fell. Um, we got a University of Georgia popcorn bottle full of popcorn. Here's the pogo stick. Let's see, look, oh, move this one thing and now I already hear stuff wanting to try to fall. Maverick Pogo Stick. The original Pogo Stick. And then other than that, there's lots of boxes. A couple mirrors, wall of boxes, wrapping paper, and a hose. And some popcorn. Yep. So this unit is, there is some furniture, but it's got a lot of boxes. All right, we're loading up. We're making our way toward the back. There's the washer and dryer that we've been on to see for a while and there was boxes all around it. Living room set over there and then back behind here, more boxes. So this unit has a ton of boxes. A lot, a lot of boxes. This box here, and just found, we're gonna see what's in it, kinda sounds interesting. It says glass show pieces, careful. Glass show pieces, careful handle. So let's see what the, Show pieces, maybe if that's what's in here. We've got a little your special dog. All right, let's keep looking. We got a Hager, Hager floral vase. <laughs> All right, I haven't really seen anything showpiece looking yet. Whatever that would mean. I guess it could mean something different to different people. Here's a $5 little, I think you put like a candle in it thing from um, Marshalls. 
Here is a broken, oh, this is a broken showpiece, I guess. But this is a $3.99 CVS vase. Let's see. What is this? A magnet. Uh, it's a, a Blackberry magnet, and it's broke. They weren't very really careful. Nope. This is a little vase. An expensive, an expensive vase. Another, it's a little turtle vase. I mean, that's cool, but that's nothing expensive. Magic strings. Everyone can be a musician. So, like a little toy thing there. All right, I don't see anything showpiece looking. There's some like floral stuff in there. That was a disappointing. <laughs> 